It's the Pauline, Pauline Pro 42cc chainsaw. It uh, starts and stalls. Starts fine, but as soon as you press the trigger, there's a trigger, it stalls. Most likely the carburetor needs to be cleaned or replaced. We'll show how to replace the carburetor. And we'll also show, we'll also show how to check if there is spark in the spark plug. So we'll open it first. There are uh, screw holes. This screw. One, two, three. Take this off with the flathead. This is the new carburetor. It's a brand new unit. Bought from eBay for fifteen dollars. Fifteen to twenty dollars you get a good good uh, unit. This is spark plug, we'll check if there is spark coming or not. So take it off and pull it to see if spark is going or not. So there's a three quarter. Spark plug looks clean, so we'll uh, put it back here and make sure this body, this side touches the body like this. So we ground it basically here to the engine block and pull the trigger. Pull this. Uh, or to see if there's spark going. So <clears throat> to check the spark, pull this up out first. So once it's out, it's gonna Give this spark here. Pull it. Focus on it. There's this spark right here. Okay. So you put this spark plug, spark plug back in. Now we'll open the carb. That's the intake. Pull it. The uh, air filter, make sure it's clean. Now, take these two nuts out and then pull this out. Mm, there is a screw here as well. I have to take this screw out too. So this is the hex screw, screw to the torque set. The flat flathead uh, can also open this. Now disconnect this. See throttle cable. Slide it out and then pull. Pull this out. This tube comes off. And 
disconnect this uh, disconnect here and slide it out carefully without breaking it. Check if uh, this gasket, that gasket here, is fine or not, and it looks good. If not, you have to replace this. Disconnect, disconnect this tube and this tube on this side. There's another tube here. Disconnect these two and then install install the new carb so put this tube and this tube back in and make sure this uh, this is the new carb now it goes into this pipe that's the intake in now and I'll put this uh, <coughs> choke lever back in it goes right here now this is the throttle cable that has to go in there it's a bit difficult so basically it has to go from the other side I think this side so there are two holes here cable has to go in the top big one so um, pull it in slide it in so this is the throttle cable we just slid it in and put this back in through this uh, two bolts and put the nuts back in to screw this top back we need T20 this is a T20 Torx and this is 8 millimeter of this nuts it's two nuts tighten it but do not over tighten Now pull the trigger to see if it works fine before you close it off. It's still working fine. Put the filter back in. I just put the filter back in, cover it, and then uh, pop it off. Make sure this is nice and tight. screws so now we put it on put the cover on and put some uh, gas oil mix this one is 40 to 1 and we'll start it up